Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the seventh annual Privacy Camp. Please give yourselves a big round of applause for being here so early in the morning. Um, so, my name is Kirsten Fiedler, I am from EDRI, um, we are one of the co-organizers of this camp, doing it for several years now. Um, yeah, this is Rocco, do you want to introduce yourself? Hello, I'm Rocco, um, I work between the University of Amsterdam and the University of Saint-Louis-Bruxelles, who is hosting us today. And together with Kirsten and Imge and the rest of the EDRI team, uh, it's the seventh time that we are organizing this and we are very proud and happy that it's still alive and actually it's getting bigger and bigger every year. So thank you very much for being here. Hi, I'm Imge. Uh, I'm from VUB LSTS, which is one of the co-organizers of the event. Yeah. Hello, I'm Andrea and I work with EDRI. Uh, and it's my first year organizing this beautiful event. And I'm really happy you're all here because it means we uh, did a job so <laughs> far. <laughs> I think you're starting with the video and ha! Yes. I'm yeah. starting with the video. So this year, there will be video recording happening of the sessions, uh, but also Teresa Reinhold will take small uh, video uh, clippets for a uh, nice promo video of the um, sessions and the whole camp, so please, if you do not want to be recorded, uh, at the registration desk, there are some red dots that you can put on you, and uh, when you're registered, if you want to be recorded, you also sign and consented for that. Um, that's that about video. Next is Imge. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'll cover food and drinks. Uh, we will have short uh, coffee breaks, which you can find listed in the schedule and one lunch break from uh, 12 to 1 p.m. Um, the food is very diverse and meant to satisfy everyone's taste. Uh, we must nevertheless ask you that if you're not vegan, uh, please allow those who can only eat vegan uh, food uh, so they can have priority in the vegan corner. And as soon as you finish, Eating, please do not trash things on the ground or on tables or on chairs. Please put it in the bins and only in the trash bins. And at the end of the day, please help us a little bit cleaning up uh, because uh, the stuff here is helping, but it's bigger than usual. So uh, please do not hesitate to lend us uh, uh, and hand. Um, for what concerns your staff, uh, there is uh, no real security and we like that so it means that you have to keep your valuable close to you. If you have left your luggage, uh, keep it only on the corner with, that we dedicate to the luggage but we cannot take responsibility for the luggage. Especially please do not leave Katarina with the responsibility of your luggage at the end of the day because it won't be nice for her to wait for you to remember that you have lost something in the registration desk. Um, yeah. uh, and then, of course, uh, there's social media, so we would like to ask you, well, you can tweet about this event if you want to. Um, the hashtag is privacycamp19, and if you do, just uh, follow the basic rules of politeness, of course, thank you. And then uh, the most important uh, piece of information that we want to share is that there is a party tonight. Um, so your conference badges are also the entrance to that party, so don't lose them. And please also don't take hundreds of them to let other people in. Um, so yeah, um, there will be an open bar uh, starting at 9, uh, no, no, at 7.30 for two hours. So the drinks are on Edry, uh, so please enjoy. And then afterwards there will be a couple of DJs. Okay, finally, and this I promise the last administrative question, <laughs> we wanted to thank our sponsor. And uh, this year, for the first time, we get FNRS, which is the Fonds National de la Scientifique, the francophone uh, funding scheme for research that is supporting us, and this <coughs> permits us to bring us more people from a wider geographical scope, but also EPIC, the EDPS, Mozilla Center, the Swedish Research Foundation, and the university itself for hosting us today. 
thank you very much for these sponsors because they make it happen. It, even if it's a low budget, uh, low threshold conference, it still costs money and it's a lot of time. And I want to thank you also all the team from Adri and Inge for all the work that they put and also Anna Alexandra uh, from our university that really helped a lot in bridging with the university and making it happen. Thank you very much, Anna Alexandra.